Hey everybody, so today's video is going to be a favorites video. This is going to be my May favorites video. I haven't done one since March, so yeah. So let's go ahead and get into my favorite. So my first favorite of the month is this. Yas. S'more cereal. Um, I did not know that this existed. Well, actually I did know that it was another brand of it. Um, but this is way cheaper because it's multi meal. And um, I saw it in the store and I was just like, you know what? I've been craving s'mores stuff lately, and I tried the s'mores Starbucks drink, and I thought that it tasted like shit. Um, so I went ahead and got this, and this is absolutely amazing. It tastes like you're eating s'mores, and it's fucking just, it's, it's crazy, because all pretty much it is is honey grams, cocoa puffs, and um, white marshmallow things like Lucky Charms. That's all it is, but it tastes amazing, and um, I need to stop eating it because I'm supposed to be losing weight right now, so... Yeah, um, yeah, okay, so let's just get on to the rest of this. Next bunch of favorites that I have are all makeup and beauty products. The first thing is this EOS lip balm that I think I've shown in a favorites video. I think I showed this in my March favorites, but I really like it. It's like this tangerine one. And so far, I haven't had any problems with it like everybody else says they're, you know, they, they have. Um, so I don't know, you know, I've been using it. Um, off and on. I mean, I even tried not using it for a while to see if something would happen, but nothing happened. My lips are fine. The next thing is this e.l.f. Uh, Tone Correcting Powder Palette. Um, there's pink, green, blue, and yellow. Can you guys see yourself in there? Look okay. it. You can see yourself. <laughs> um, but I've been using the green a lot because I have a lot of red on my face. And it, it works really good. Um, it's not the best thing. Like, you can still, some, you can still see the red a little bit. But um, it's been working for me, and it was only like three bucks, so, you know, why the fuck not? Then the next thing, um, I showed this a long time ago, but I'm using it again, and that is the Dream Lumi Touche Camouflant um, Highlighting Concealer. It's Touch. I think I was just reading the French part or something. But um, it's Dream Lumi Touch uh, Highlighting Concealer. It's by Maybelline. This is what it looks like. Um, you take it off, and it's got this weird-looking, like, lip gloss brush that we like used to use in high school and um if for a highlighter it's really it works really really good it does pick up on my dry patches a lot so i might have to try something else because i have like a dry patch like right under here and it like cakes up right there and nope <laughs> that's not gonna work for me girl um and then the last thing is um this clean color retractable eyebrow pencil and i got this from the jewelry box for a dollar and it's in dark brown and I think this is just a little too dark for me, so I have to, like, you know, figure out how to use it. But so far, I really like it. It's double-sided. It's got these bristles so that you could comb out your brows. And then it's got this retractable, um, I don't know if you guys can see. Can you guys see that? Yeah. Um, but it works pretty good. I'm wearing it right now, so I don't know if you guys could tell. Maybe my eyebrows are just a little tad darker than they usually are. Um, but I really like it. This is faster than the powder that I've been using, so, you know, I don't know. Might make the transition to this. I don't know. I, it's really difficult with my eyebrows because I like them to be perfect even though they're not. I like them to be on fleek um, whenever I can. But, yeah. And the next group of things are um, all body products, and they're all from Axe. Because for a while I wasn't using them. Um, I used to use them when I was younger, but like I just like no, like in high school I used them a little bit um, because they were but they were expensive. And even now they're still kind of a little bit expensive. But um, I've been using the Axe White Label Night Body Wash, and this smells fucking amazing. And it's just oh, and I love the bottles. Like they're all like pretty and like I don't know I really like it. And this smells really good and it's purple and. Mm, yeah, I smell super fresh when I come out to shower, yas. And then the next thing is this Axe Dry Spray Antiperspirant. Um, it says fresh for 48 hours, and I believe that, you know, maybe I have good underarms, but um, when I'm wearing this, girl, I don't need to refresh because I smell good. But um, yeah, this works really good. It's empty, so I'm going to have to buy another one. And then the last thing is this Axe Night um, Shampoo Two-in-One Conditioner. And the funny thing about this is that you know how the, the body wash is purple and it has like this purple, 
you know, theme, but this shit is green. I don't get that. And I've heard a lot of people say it's green too, so I just thought maybe it was fucked up or something, but no, they're green. What? what? That's really weird. I don't know. I don't get that, but it smells, it has like this eucalyptus pine needle type of smell. And the last thing I have to show you guys is the Garnier Blackhead Eliminating Scrub. Unclogs pores, clears complexions, and has charcoal, and this is specifically for oil skin, oily skin, um, which I have, and I got it bad. Okay, I got it bad. Um, and I've been trying to find something that... And I know it's not possible, I don't think it's ever possible to, co to completely wipe off the fucking oil off of your face and keep it off for hours and hours. Um, if that's possible, let me know. Let me know what product does that. But so far, I have not found nothing that does that. I don't even think it even exists. But I've been trying to find something that keeps the oil off longer because I was using the, fuck, Clean and Clear, I think. And it was keeping it off for like an hour. Just an hour. And an hour later, covered in oil. And then, um... I used another thing and that didn't even do anything. It just made my skin feel really ugly and it broke me out. Um, and then I went and I tried this and this is like six or seven dollars so this is kind of pricey. Um, but I tried this and it has charcoal and all that stuff in there and this um, keeps the oil off of my face for like two hours, maybe two or three hours. And I, am, I, I was like, bitch, you're keeping my face clean? an oil-free girl, I, oh my god. So yes, I am in love with this right now. I'm gonna be buying this, I just know I'm gonna love this. Um, but yeah, it's it says after one week, but no, really like after like two tries. Two tries and your face feels amazing, it unclogs your pores. Like my face is pretty clear using this, so. I would recommend this if you got oily skin and you need to clean that face, girl. Yans! But that is it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys next time with another video. Until then, let me know a couple of your favorites this month or if there's anything that you've tried in this video. Let me know if you enjoyed it or if you hated it. And yes, I will see you guys next time. Bye!